Pat McAfee and his goons are in WWE 2K24. And people are like, well, why do we need the Pat McAfee show in WWE? And I get it because wrestling fans like Pat McAfee, but don't really like or would like the Pat well, McAfee show. It's two are, worlds coming together that kind of just they, they well, clash. But that's because his co-hosts are irrelevant. To they, that's what I'm getting to. They're yeah. irrelevant to the wrestle wrestlers. They're yeah. just goons that are in the sports world. Great. That doesn't translate to this one. And because of that, their goon, his goons, excuse me, went on a little bit of a rant talking about how no one wants to play with some of these wrestlers. So who cares? Well, it's you, right. You have the actual quote. I have the story up. I'm getting it up. I was just okay because the, the quote story. is like way worse. Yeah. Um. I he was specifically to... talking about NXT talent. Yeah, I'm trying to find the legit quote because I want to. Nope, I clicked on the wrong thing. Shit. Um. Sorry. Do you have it up? I'll um, try and find it. I can just type it quick. I thought what I clicked on. No. Um, um okay um let's see. no pat mcafee create back here we go all right um pat mag yeah it's so to, they called it the worst dlc of all time that's rude you know a lot of people are pissed especially that d butch connor myself aj and I are, are in it because they want some of these other losers that no one has ever heard of from NXT to be in the game. Why are these guys not in the DLC pack? Well, it's because no one wants to play with them. That's why, said Schmidt. He had, at first, it was like, man, I should be upset with that these people are pissed that we're in the game. No, absolutely not. Fuck them. That's kind of where I stand. Um, Yeah, see, here's my thing. It, back to what I started this off with. <coughs> Bless Sorry. you. Think I, it. it's two worlds. They don't get it. They're nostalgic wrestling fans from the nineties that don't care about it now. Like it, this is what's going to happen. I think Sarah, that, I, I, yeah. This, you, so you dug the hole. Yeah. I you think dug the hole. Um, sorry. Yeah. Um, sorry. My brother-in-law is asking me if I want food. <laughs> Um, okay, I can keep. I can keep anyway, okay, okay, so I understand wanting to like defend yourself for being in the game, I guess, and like that was maybe yeah. why he was a little bit worked up about this topic. So he was just like, "All right, I'm frustrated, so I am gonna lash out, I guess." But it's also like, it okay, out. the WWE fans and wrestling fans in general are there's a it. lot more of them than Pat McAfee show fans, okay? Secondly, there were people who were trying to defend him and being like, oh, he's just being a heel. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Is he in no. wrestling? Is he in wrestling? Who's being a heel? Who the, the, the dude, the dude talking, whatever the hell his name is. They were oh, saying Schmidt that- Oh, Schmidt and Boston. Yeah, Bonnie. whatever yeah, the fuck no, his name not, is. He, but that's no, the they're thing. they're not in it. Wrestling fans don't know who the hell you are, brother. They so don't. people trying to defend him and be like, oh, he's just being a heel. Who the hell is he? No one knows who he is. It's you Pat know. McAfee and those other guys. Like, the only other one I know is Boston Connor, and that's because he's a Patriots fan. That's the only reason why I know we who he is. We stand Boston Connor here, okay? It's like, I, that's the only reason, though. Everybody else, like, it, unless it's a former yeah, NFL okay. player, I don't know who you are. So, the thing that I, I, I took issue with, other than that crazy way of trying to defend him, is... Don't downplay or disparage the talent in wrestling and don't their do. dedication or how good they are or how many fans they have or they don't have. You don't have to do that in an attempt to defend yourself being in the game. You can say, like, if you guys are mad about me being in the game, then that sucks for you because I'm in a video game. You know, like, you didn't There's have to. There's a better to, way to go about it, correct. You did, yeah, you can make fun of the fans for being way. mad that you're in the game, but you're able to take a victory lap around them because they're never going to be in a WWE 2K game. You know what I mean? Like, take that route and go after the fans that are trolling you or talking crap to you online. You don't yeah. have to involve 
the wrestling talent that's in WWE. Because like exactly. Shawn Michaels responded and it kind of felt oh, like... Oh, I'm getting there. Oh, I'm getting there. And oh, it's I, like, I have the whole report up. I, I think I was, some of it was, okay. you know, some of it is also going to be just like trying to be a I'll little wait. cheeky. But um, I think because no. the clip went viral, not to mention Pat McAfee didn't do himself any favors by laughing about it. It's just like, this is just another situation for me where I just don't like him because I just don't think he know, respects the business it. in that way. So it's like, you need to defend the other company that you work for. You might not be getting paid as much as ESPN is paying you, but you can't just like take your days off from WWE, allowing the dudes that you do the show with like talk shit. Like you can't, All right. we don't, we don't live in that world. That's not okay. I have the entire thing up now. And going off of you, Carmen Petrovich, who one of my favorite yeah. rising stars in NXT, uh, she responded by tweeting, God forbid fans want to play with wrestlers in a wrestling game. Yeah. Put respect on hashtag WWE NXT. Mm -hmm. And now we can get to the Shawn Michaels quote. Jesus, Pitts hit the right thing. Um, he quoted, I have it. Um, I'll put my, you tagged him in the tweet. Uh, and said, I'll put my four up against your four any day of the week. Just say when you want your ass kicking. Get off yeah, so jock. See, it's like it's like he's taking a shot back, get but not really. You know what I mean? It's like they were like, you can say no, something because if you don't ring. say something, people are going to be like, why didn't you defend the company? But it's also not being too serious, probably because of the Pat McAfee connection, but it, it was just not, it was just dirty. Just like not necessary, it, just classless. Like I said, like when you are trying to defend yourself or whatever, there are so many ways to go about it. You do not have to involve anybody else that has nothing to do with the situation to make yourself look better. Like you just don't. And as a 30, 40 something year old dude, you should know that by now. Like, the internet shouldn't have to tell you. All I'm saying is this is, is going to set up them fighting again. And nope. we're going to get... Yes, it is. Don't... No, you don't even yes, know what I was going to say. You have no idea what I was going to say. I, I don't. I was saying I was going to say general. nobody wants to see that. It, it doesn't matter. It's happening. Like, I don't... No. It, it's inevitable. No what, one wants to see it. If anything, it's, people it's, see it less than they did the first time. So, I disagree. Yeah, no. You don't. You don't think wrestling fans want to see these four dudes get their ass kicked? You really think that that's what they would do? A thousand percent. It's money. What? Including McAfee? Yes. No. Uh yes. 